Hey guys, in this lesson, we're going to introduce you how to charge and turn on SpiderPi. As you can see, SpiderPi is equipped with a voltage display module on the back of body. It can display battery voltage data in real time. For better experience, when the battery voltage is lower than 10, SpiderPi should be charged. Before charging, please check whether connect the red wire to red one and the black wire to black before charging. Then, use the available charger to plug end of the charger to the hold of the Raspberry Pi expansion board on the back. Now, the LED indicator on charger turns green. When the charger is connected to the NAC power outlet, the LED indicator turns red. It means that the battery is charging. When the LED indicator turns green again, it means the battery is charged and ready to use. At this time, do not keep charging. After charging, now we can turn on spider pipe. Check the body light of power once again. Okay, switch on Raspberry Pi expansion board on the back. At this time, the glowing ultrasonic sensor will light up blue. The Raspberry Pi is a small mini computer. It usually takes about 1 minute to boot up from the time it is powered on. Then, buzzer will send a big sound. Spider Pi will stand up. It means the robot is turned on successfully. Please know that the ultrasonic sensor will be off. After turning on, Raspberry Pi will be in an AP hotspot mode and launch a Wi-Fi hotspot named with the first letters HW. How to connect to Wi-Fi hotspot will be introduced in the next lesson. Okay, this is the end of the video. If you want to learn more about SpiderPi, please keep watching the following video. Thank you.